Uh, this is Shalom. This is Yahweh Patak coming at you again, you know, with this wisdom through the Spirit and power Yahweh Shem Yahweh You know, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who rule well. This is Ecclesiasticus 12 and 10. Never trust thine enemy for like as oil. I mean, salakia, not oil. Iron rusted, so is his wickedness. So, the so-called white man, his wickedness doesn't get any better. It gets worse. Because when iron rusts, it gets worse. It's just rusting. It gets worse. When something rusts, it gets worse. It doesn't get better. Verse 11. Though he humble himself and go crouching, Yet take good heed and beware of him, and thou shalt be unto him as if thou hast, hast wiped a looking glass, and thou shalt see, thou shalt know that his rust has not been altogether wiped away. So the so-called white man, his rust, his wickedness is not gone, man. Just because he gave you a raise at your job, just because he uh, being nice, all nice, coming up to you, uh, saying he's a man of God. Just because he doing all these things, um, if you wipe if you wipe that shit away, you will see that his wickedness is 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 still there, man. It's still there. It ain't went nowhere. It ain't wiped away. His wickedness ain't wiped away, man. So that's why you can't trust these damn devils. Because they they was created to be the devil, and if they not being that. If they, if they not being a devil like they're created to be, you better watch that type that type of that type of uh Edomite. Because he a slick devil. He trying to he trying to be slick with it. Verse 12. Set him not by thee, lest when he hath overthrown thee, he stand up in thy place. Neither let him sit at thy right hand, lest he seek to take thy seat. And thou at the last remember my words and be pricked therewith who will pity a charmer charmer that is bitten with a serpent or any such as come nigh wild beasts so so one that goeth to a sinner and is defiled with him and his sins who will pity for a while he will abide with thee but if thou begin to fall he would tarry. You can't trust the wicked. Verse 16. An enemy speaketh sweetly with his lips, but in his heart he imagineth how to throw thee into a pit. He will weep with it. He will weep with his eyes, but if he find opportunity, he will not be satisfied with blood. So, man, be careful, man. Never trust thine enemy, like verse 10 says. For like as iron rusted, so is it wickedness. So with that, I'll be edified. Shalom.